Howdy, Nickinator here, and uh, we are starting off a brand new game series right here, all right? Another big game, another big open world game. I'm still in the process of doing Hogwarts right now, so uh, still wrapping that up, but I'm starting off Red Dead 2 as well, and we're gonna be, uh, we're gonna be doing this up. So, a couple things to mention. This isn't my first playthrough, technically. Um, I haven't beat the game before, though. I, I played a little bit on PlayStation 4 when it came out, and I, I pretty much spent most of the time, like, mostly, like, the main story. I didn't do any side stuff. I didn't do any of the other extra stuff, really. Um, I did the main story, and I didn't finish the whole thing. So my plan is now, here we are, a few years later, and uh, I think we're going to... I mean, how, actually, how long ago was Red Dead 2 come out? Like five years ago or something? Must have been at least. Um, but yeah, we're on PC though. So we're going to have better graphics, uh, higher frame rates. I just ran the, the, the benchmark test. We got 60 to 110 was my range on like, well, high to ultra graphics or whatever. Uh, I don't know. I pretty much left things how it set it up. I don't know, just kind of set it up, and I was like, all right, looks good to me. Just a couple minor things, uh, personal preference things in the settings, and, like, uh, turn motion blur off. And, um, yeah, so we're going to have a great time on Red Dead Redemption 2 here. So the plan, I think, is to... I don't know how I don't know how 100% works in this game. I don't know how hard 100% to get in this game is. Uh, we might try and go for it, but at the very least, we're going to do a really deep dive into the game. We're going to try to explore as much as a storyline, explore as much as the other side quests, and uh, try to do as much as we can in Red Dead as we can. And, um, yeah, I think that's all I got to say before we kick off the game. Um, I'm going to be playing keyboard and mouse. All right. Hogwarts I did. Controller. I feel like this game, because the way it handles the shooting, I want to experience it on keyboard and mouse. I'm more more of a, a mouse player when it comes to first person shooters, anyway. Um, so yeah, let's hit the story. We're gonna let this load for a second, and here we go. We're starting off Red Dead Two. I'm like so excited. Let's freaking go. Uh. Also, I think, like, so the horses and stuff, like, taking the horses on long distances, depending on how it goes and whatnot, I haven't decided it. Uh, whatever goes, goes. Might have to edit some stuff out to make it seem like, unless there's fast travel. I can't remember if there's fast travel in this game, but anyhow. Here we go. We're, we're starting. Um, what's this say? I don't know the first word. I'm so bad at I didn't get to read it. Oh, no. No. Oh, this is starting off terrible already. America was becoming a land of laws. Ooh. So 1899, I think it said. Is that what it said? I don't know. Even the West had mostly been tamed. Hey, we're out in the West here. A few gangs still roamed, but they were being hunted down and destroyed. Oh no. Rockstar Games. Here we go. I guess another thing to mention too, I haven't played Red Dead 1. If there's an easy way to play it, I don't think there's, you can't play it on PC yet, right? And I don't really have a console to play it on, so. Unless anybody have a, a way for me to play Red Dead 1, legally, on PC. I don't know. I'll do that as well, but for now, we're, we're doing Red Dead. Another thing, I'm always down for game suggestions, so to keep it simple, sometimes it's hard to think of a suggestion, too. I have, um, I'm going to have a link. Abigail says he's dying, Dutch. We'll have to stop someplace. Sorry. Okay, Arthur's out looking. Yeah. I sent him up ahead. Uh, if we don't stop soon, we'll all be dying. This weather, it's May. 
I'm just hoping the law got as lost as we did. There. Oh. Arthur. Arthur. Arthur Morgan. I found a place where we can get some shelter. Let Davy rest while he, you know, an old oh. man in town. Abandoned. It ain't far. Come on. Come on. Yeah. Just a little blizzard. Nothing to worry about. Nothing to worry about. <laughs> All right. What was I talking about before? I already lost it. It's already gone. Oh, game suggestions and all that. So we're on chapter one. All right, here we go. Beginning chapter one. I, I we can't talk. We can't talk right now. We gotta let the the, the cutscenes go. All right, we got our shelter here. Bring him in here. Get that fire lit, quick. Miss Jones, bring in whatever blankets we have. Mr. Pearson, see what we've got in terms of food. Davy's dead. There was nothing more you could have done. What are we going to do? We need supplies. Oh, no. Well, first of all, you're going to stay here, and you were going to get yourself warm. Now, I sent John and Mike scouting out ahead. Arthur and I... We're gonna ride out, see if we can find one of them. And this, just for a short bit, and I don't see what other choice we have. Listen, listen to me, all of you, for a moment. Now we've had, well, a bad couple of days. I loved Davy, Jenny. Sean, Mac, they may be okay. We don't know. But we lost some folks. Now, if I could throw myself in the ground, in their stead, I'd do it, gladly. But we are gonna ride out, and we are gonna find some food. Everybody? We're safe now. There ain't nobody following us through a storm like this one. And by the time they get here, well, we're gonna be, we're gonna be long gone. We've been through worse than this before. Mr. Pearson, Miss Grimshaw, I need you to turn this place into a camp. We may be here for a few days. Now, all of you, all of you, Get yourselves warm. Stay strong. Stay with me. We ain't done yet. Come on, Arthur. All right. Hell of a speech. Dang. We ain't run into them yet. So they both must have headed down the hill. Sure. Hey, I ain't had time to ask. What really went down back there on that boat? We missed you. That's what happened. Come on. <laughs> oh. All righty then. Hey, you need horses? Oh, yeah. Hey, Mr. Smith, get yourself indoors. You need to rest that hand. I'll live. Get indoors, son. Here we go. Bye. Dang, look at the horse tracks Please. in the snow and stuff. You strong. Oh, yes. Okay. Oh, it's amazing. All right. Let's head out. Another thing to mention. Show what we're gonna find out here, Dutch. We're gonna find. We have to try. Stay close. We'll do our best to stick to the trail. This goddamn weather. In two days or more like this now. Oh, it has to blow over soon. All right, let's go. Uh, but yeah, another thing I forgot to mention. Starting off, our parts. The video size is gonna be yeah. roughly the same as I did Hogwarts. Bridge coming up. Um, Take it easy. It's gonna be, uh, oh, okay. 
It's gonna be between like an hour or two. I don't think there's gonna be any at, a, at an hour probably, but it, it really depends on how the game goes. But more like an hour and a half to two hours long. Can't believe we lost Davy too. He's the last one, Arthur. No more. We need to get those people warm and fed. At least we don't need to worry about Pinkertons tailing us in this. Uh, All right, days, Pinkertons. We'll be on the other side. You need to help me pick the others back up. You're the only one I can rely on to stay strong right now. Hey, I think I see something up the path. Uh, where? How do you see anything up there? What is going on? You up ahead. Who's there? How did you even see that? That's wild, dude. Micah. <laughs> Jesus. Gentlemen. Found anything? I think so. Found a little homestead down that way. Okay. Anyone home? Sure. Place is blazing with light and noise. Sounded like a party. Let's go see. Follow me. <clears throat> How's Davy doing? Well, he didn't make it. Nor did little Jenny. Poor Davy. Jenny. Davy was a real fighter. Both of them calendar boys is. Or <laughs> was. Yeah. And Mac, Sean, we don't know. Quite a business. Oh, this is amazing. I'm glad you're all right, Micah. Always. Ask him if he's seen John. Hey, have you seen John, Micah? <laughs> Things always turn out right for that boy. I hope Mac and Sean are still out there somewhere too. Move up, Arthur. I'll cover the rear. God damn it. Sorry. I'll cover the rear. All right. Here we go. Oh, we could talk. Are you sure about this? Mr. Morgan, I never thought I would be so pleased to see your face. Oh. I'm kind of lonely out here. Oh. Where's everyone else? Old mining camp back up the hill, huddled around a fire waiting for daddy to put food on the table. I've said it before, we got too many mouths to feed. Mm. Well, we got a few less now, so you should be happy. That ain't fair, Arthur. Jesus. I earn my share. You think it's unreasonable to expect others to do the same? So, this ha Okay. Oh. Let's keep it down now, gentlemen. It's just up ahead. Stop and stand. Oh, we got a camp up here. Best you two lie low on this. Hold. Okay. All right. Let's head down there. Okay, let's go. God, look at the snow and everything. Oh my god, I love it. It's so cool. Oh, um, I figured I'm gonna let this one be an ass one. You guys want subtitles on at all? Let me know if you want subtitles on. I think I'm gonna go this one without, but I will definitely tend to the audience here. Um, I find my problem with, with subtitles, even though I use subtitles quite a bit. Um, a lot of times I tend to just read the subtitles instead of like, looking at what's going on in the cutscene. You know what I mean? This. We don't want to spook these fine people. Someone's having fun in there. You two, get yourself out of sight. Hey, look how deep One lonely man is a lot less intimidating than three nasty-looking degenerates. <laughs> Arthur, in that cattle shed on the left. <laughs> I could get down behind that wagon and... All right, here we go. Go to the shed and press Q to take cover. Here we go. Hello? Shut up, Billy. Excuse me. Hello? <laughs> Oh, well, hello, friend. What you want? I am very sorry. 
to disturb you. Uh, my friends and I, well, we got into some trouble up the way, lost in the storm. Ah, uh, gentlemen. We can't help you, mister. There's a guy coming out the side. I got folks. Arthur. Dying on the Arthur, we got a problem. Folks. <laughs> There's a corpse right here. What? Now, I, I just Arthur. need... Some There's a body in the wagon. I hear you. Just Gentlemen. keep your eyes on Dutch. Please. I think you should. Okay, we gotta get our weapon wheel out. Here we go. We got a gun. Oh, we're gonna take them out. Now, friend, I ain't asking for much. Please, I am kind of desperate. Hey, I don't believe it. Come here, partner. Uh-oh. Come here! Yeah! Look out! There's more Oh, I, I can't aim. Hold on, I gotta I gotta warm up my uh my aim here for a second here. It's been a while since I actually shot with uh keyboard and mouse. That guy's still not dead? Oh no. Oh no. Get, get in cover! Oh no. Oh, I'm so good at this game. Where? This way? Who's running where? This way? Uh oh. What's happening? Oh no. Why is my screen doing that? Closer to the house. Arthur, let's go search oh. the cabin. I didn't I didn't see who he was talking about who ran away. Oh, we could pick up items in the house. Smells like a party in here. Turn the place upside down. Grab as many supplies. Oh as you yeah. Can. See, we I don't remember any of this, which is crazy. Medicine. Whiskey. Your health core drains over time. Get your strength up for the ride back. Huh. Looks like the poor bastard was married to. B to open your social menu. Okay. At some point. If we can't eat it or drink it, put it down. Yes, sir. O'Driscoll's. Oh, I don't believe it. It's a strange one, all right. Maybe they're hiding up here too. Oh, Driscoll's. A big price on Colm O'Driscoll's head. Nearly as big as the one on yours. Yeah. We'll take some of this. Health cure. Inspect blood. Big old pool of blood on the floor here. Oh boy. I saw. Probably the poor bastard who lived here. Micah found a dead body in the wagon outside. Okay, so we're gonna take all this stuff from their house. Oh my god, look at all the stuff around here. Place is dry and warm. We could maybe move the women and Jack down here. Maybe. We'll see how they are when we get back. I don't really want us to split up. Keep searching while I pack these on the horses. Okay. I think I searched the whole house, though. Meet me out here when you're done. Oh, never mind. We can actually climb the ladder and go up there. Oh, yes. Didn't even see the ladder to begin with. Here we go. Hopefully there's not, like... Wait. Hello? Um. <laughs> Alrighty then. I guess he got shot out of the window. How are you supposed to get up there? Is there a way to... You're just supposed to pull yourself up or what? Huh. I think you just... Okay. Micah, Arthur, Tab. Keep looking for stuff. What? Arthur, go see if there's anything in that barn. Micah. Go you search the cabin. See All what right. we missed. I gotta search Go. the barn. Oh, 
I hear horses running over there. Look at them. Oh boy. We got a gun out for a reason. Oh shit. Oh no. Hey. I'm gonna break your neck. F. What's going on? Now this guy just jumped me. How do you uh? How do you dodge? I don't know. I'm just gonna just gonna beat his ass. Yeah. Oh. Oh shit. Should I kill him? No. Hold the focus, interrogate. In interrogate. Find out interrogate. what they're doing here and where Colm is. Oh, this son of a bitch will talk. Where's Colm O'Driscoll? Oh, shit. With the others. At an old mining camp southwest of here. Near the lake. What are you bastards doing? Why are you up here? Uh, we're fixing to rob some train. Gonna blow the tracks. No, I don't know more than that, I swear. Blow the tracks? <laughs> Jesus. <laughs> well, I would say it looks like you have this, Arthur. Do what you want with him. I don't care. But bring oh, that horse. We're gonna have a choice done. to kill him or not. Oh, well, he seems pretty innocent, innocent right? <laughs> Please. Please. Alright. Get the hell out of here. Go. I mean, we'll let him go. We'll let him go. He wasn't too much of a problem. He kind of... He tackled us, but... It's all good. Seemed like he was just scared. Oh, is this going to be my horse? Come here, girl. It's all good. Dang. Horse bonding level one. All right, so we're going to have to take care of a horse. Of course, of course. We, we definitely got to do that. Here, girl. Got anyway. my coffee. That looks like a decent horse. You should keep him. Get that horse hitch. Don't want him bolting. Oh, we can hitch it over here. Let's get the noise. Mike, what the hell do you? Oh, I found in the cellar. Why did you? Leave her alone. I wasn't doing nothing. She's one of them Odriscoll's. No, she ain't. Oh, shit. Michael, look at her. Don't throw the knife. Oh, no. Oh, it's on fire. Ah, oh, shit. Yes. Now, it is going to be okay. We mean you no harm. Miss. Miss. Come on. It'll be okay. Well. We need to get out of here and quick. Come on now. Oh boy. So much for using this as a camp. You I mean, okay, they came three days ago. And my husband, they. Okay. Miss, you are safe now. And can't stay here. It'll be nice and warm here, though. You come with us. Of course. Yes. It's okay. We're bad men. He ain't them. It's okay. Get on. We'll keep you safe until you figure out what you want to do. Well, at least What's we collected name, all Miss? the food out of there. Miss. Adler. Adler. Oh, I recognize Sadie it. Okay. Adler. Sadie Adler. Mrs. Oh, yes. I... He. He was my husband. Oh no. Damn. Hey, somebody's coming. Settle Looks down. Like it's Dutch. Hey, everybody, Dutch is back. How'd you get on? 
Uh, Mike had found a homestead, but he weren't the first. Colm O'Driscoll and his scum, they beat us to it. Uh, uh, we found some of them there, but there is more about, apparently. Scouting the train. Thank you. And that's the last thing we need right now, Dutch. Well, it is what it is. But we found some supplies, some blankets, a little bit of food, and this poor soul, Mrs. Adler. Miss Tilly, Miss Karen, would you warm her up? Give her a drink or something? And Mrs. Adler, it's gonna be okay. You're safe now. They turned her into a widow. Animals. I need some rest. I haven't slept in three days. You're over here. Miss O'Shea will show you the way. Mr. Morgan, we put you in a room over here. Thank you, Miss Grimshaw. Mr. Bell, you're with the fellas over there. What? Well, how come Arthur gets a room and I get a bunk bed next to Bill Williamson <laughs> oh, and a God. bunch of darkies? Get yourself to bed. <laughs> Dang. All right, so it's morning now. Are we all alive still? That fire's going. He ain't been seen in days. Weather ain't let up. He's strong. It's always way and deep. He's smart. Strong, at least. Hello, Arthur. Abigail. Arthur, how you doing? Just fine, Abigail. And you? I need you to... I I'm sorry. I'm sorry to ask, but... It's little John. He's got himself caught into a scrape again. He ain't been seen in two... Two days. Your John will be fine. I mean, he may be as dumb as rocks and as dull as rusted iron, but that ain't changing because he got caught in some snowstorm. Please go take a look. Javier? Yes. Javier, will you ride out with Arthur <clears throat> to take a look for John? <clears throat> You're the two best fit men we've got. Now? She's... We're all... Yeah, we're pretty worried about him. I know. The situation were reversed. And he looked for me. Thank you. All right, we'll go look for John. This way. We know he's dumb as nails. John was headed up the river. For all we know... He kept riding north and never looked back. He wouldn't leave. Not like that. Uh, wouldn't be the first time. So bright. <laughs> Seems the smoke, there's white boys. snow blowing around everywhere. Well, seems somebody left. Was it John? Recently. And that way. Sure, well, come on then. There's some tracks leading to the river. A few hours ago, most. Oh, look at that. You can see even see the old tracks. Oh, that's kind of neat. You think it's John? You tell me. These are horse tracks for sure, but it could be anyone. Let's just see where they lead. So, you were there, Javier. What really happened on that boat? We had the money. It seemed fine. And suddenly they were everywhere. Bounty hunters? No, Pinkertons. Pinkerton. It was crazy. Raining bullets. Take it slow. Big ravine here. Dutch killed a girl. Oh, I don't. I, I, th this bad game, I'm way. sorry. First person is. No. Nope. But it was a bad situation. That ain't like him, though. Gotta go. go left. All the way around this little, uh. 
Davey got shot. Mac and John, both shot too. Sean, we don't even know. I'm surprised we escaped at all. That's a big drop. Oh. By the time you boys showed up from the other side of town, we were only just holding on. Bad business, all right. Ooh. Damn snow's coming in hot again. We'll lose these tracks if we don't move fast. So I feel like the Pinkertons are going to be like, that's going to be the end, probably, right? Pinkertons. It's going to be the final kind of thing. And so what I'm looking for, maybe, maybe in, uh, as, as it goes for like spoilers and stuff, I'm not, I'm not looking to see like spoilers or any of that, like backseat gaming, but, um, a lot of fresh snow here. I am open uh, for say I missed something. We can't follow nothing. Uh, let's push on a little a lot bit. of talking in this game, a lot Maybe of dialogue we'll for sure. Almost there. Oh but uh, if I do miss anything, I'm open for anybody to say like, oh, you know, there was there was this and it's already passed. Can't go back. That's it, right? Um, and I'm always open for discussion and John stuff. That, that is good. I like that. Let's see if he can hear us. Man, look at that horse, man. Oh. Oh! I hear him. Come on. Up there. Come on, let's go. Oh boy. He's coming from up ahead somewhere. I don't All right. Think we can go much further on the horses. We'll have to walk from here. I grab that shotgun from your horse. Who knows what's up ahead? You can only carry one side sidearm at a time. You can swap your carried weapons with. Okay, hold on. Hold tab to view your stored weapons. You can bring a. You can bring a shotgun. You getting that gun then? Come on. So I'm wondering. Is it better to use a shotgun for this mission then? Because I like that revolver. We're going to see. But other, like, uh, I do like that revolver. It's pretty neat. Get some good headshots with that. I mean, uh, my aim's going to need a little bit of work, but. <laughs> no, in this game, by the end of it, I'll be a professional, right? You sure about this? Oh, shit. Oh, my. There's no way. We would way. be sliding down this. Okay. <laughs> right here. off the cliff. Oh my gosh, though. Look at You're telling me. Look at this peak. Oh my don't fall off that. <laughs> That's so wild. Drops down here. Watch yourself. Watch out here. Yeah. Oh my. Watch your head here. Oh, look at this. <laughs> okay, from here. But yeah, this game's got like, I know this game's got many hours. Can we eat something for stamina? I think we should have that. To the wall. Up here. There we go. Come on. Come on. Yeah, I'd say the this game is probably between 60 and 100 hours of of content, but we'll see. We'll see. I am not looking to rush it at all. I've I've had a bad habit before in the past of rushing games, so I want to take my time. Yo, Johnny boy. John, you there? I'm here. Oh. Down on the ledge. All right. That's John. We're coming. Hey. Where is he? Down here. All right. Hot down, Marsh. 
Sebastian? He's down here. Oh no. That's quite a scratch you got there. Oh boy. Never thought I'd say this, but good to see you, Arthur Morgan. He was attacked by something. Moles or you don't look so good. I don't feel too good neither. <laughs> Freezing. <laughs> don't die just yet, cowboy. Come on, compadre. <laughs> We're gonna walk back in this deep snow with him on our damn we are strong as game. shit. Let's try this way. Hey, you a sorry side. Can't argue with you there. Look at this cinematic See, view. I told Dutch you weren't the right man for this. I'm sure you did. Oh, you alright? I don't think so. Come on. Hopefully this will lead us out. <laughs> this is pretty neat the way they do these cutscenes. Oh no. You see that? This is like a movie, man. Freaking rock star. They do come up with pretty neat games. Don't distract them while you get to the horses. Go. Draw them off. Okay, here we go, John. Wolves, man. We'll leave them to Arthur. Come here, Wolves. Arthur, distract them. Keep them off us. Hey! How do I roll away? Good work, Arthur. Bang. Okay, let's get going before any more of these bastards show up. Alright. I'm down. Let's get out of here. Here, girl. Yeah, let's go, let's go. Oh my god, you can even see his blood dripping off into the snow. Wait, where are we going? Where are we go? Moving, let's go. Oh my be fine. Let's stay close. We don't want anyone else getting lost. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You'll be fine. It's just like a, a dog bite. Uh, knew a fella. Got bit by a dog. He died an hour later. You ain't gonna die. Not yet. Are we gonna come across more walls? I have to shoot. Down the oh, hill. yeah. Here we go. Get oh shit! Oh no! Oh no! Oh no! <laughs> Get up, Arthur! Stop rolling, you son of a bitch! Oh shit! Yep. Oh, we're gonna fail. Oh no! <laughs> we already failed! Bro, I hit the rock, I tumbled over my horse. Wait, restart mission, retry checkpoint. Come on then, let's get back to Not the restart others. the whole mission, Jesus. Almost yeah. clicked that. Alright. I don't feel too good. Oh, we can use our revolver here too. Alright, I like it's that. Just like a, a dog bite. Just like a dog bite. You know, fella, got bit by a dog. Died an hour later. You ain't gonna die. Not yet. This, this is gonna be uh, a great playthrough here. Gonna be so many deaths. Coming down the hill. Oh no. Oh no. This is worse. Get the hell out of here. Get up. Look out on the right. We got more wolves on the left. Alejandro de mi. Get out of here. Oh, we killed it, I think. Oh. 
<laughs> you just run into them. What the hell? so. Jesus. You still with us, Marston? Just about. You're gonna be okay. Holy. Thanks for coming for me. Of course. A bullet in Blackwater, now this. You had a hell of a time. And Arthur always says, I'm lucky. None of us are lucky right now. How are the sounds in the game, by the way? I feel like the dialogue's quite quiet. Should ride in the water for a bit. Try to lose a scent. Don't want to leave a trail right back to camp. You know, we're gonna need to come up with a better story for that scar. Mm -hmm. So, freezing, bleeding, starving? Damn near getting eaten to death ain't good enough for you. Here, let's cross to the left. Yeah, come on. So yeah, so far let's it's... Push hard and get back. I'm finding it hard so to control. Ahead, John. That's where we camped. Nearly there. It's hard to control the horse with like keyboard. I feel like this is where like a controller would benefit, but it, for shooting, Go even on. though controllers got lock Go on, on, I just down off this horse. I enjoy shooting with mouse. Yo yo. Can we get some help. We got Need John. Help Come on, help him down. You're alive. You're alive. Come on, here we go. There we go. Ah, you oh, careful. The blood. Oh, oh my leg. God. Oh, come on, let's get you warm. Thank you. Thank you both. This is a new low, <laughs> even by your standards. Thank you, Arthur. Thank you. You got any other lost maidens need saving? <laughs> Not today. Have you and Dutch talked about how we're going to get out of this? I was just discussing with Herr Strauss <laughs> when the weather breaks. I uh, suppose we'll have to keep heading east. East? Into all that? That's civilization. I know. The West is where our problems are worse. Come on, Herr Strauss. Let's get warm. Thank you, Mr. Morgan. <sighs> we have been running for weeks. We got an achievement. We found shelter and been resting here in some old abandoned mining town while we wait the thaw. Hardly the spring I had been hoping for. Events and interest location noted in your journal as you explore. Hold J to view it. Mission complete. F1 for details. Oh no, we get. We wait. Oh no. Bronze awarded. You get a. Oh. Kill all the wolves without taking any damage. Complete with at least 80% accuracy. Oh, we're gonna get bronze on everything. Well, we're safe here. Oh no. Warm enough. Search drawer. I guess. What drawer? What drawer? Oh. You sound doubtful. Huh? Doubtful, just worried. We have been shot at before, Jose. Yeah, we need their stuff. Anything new. J for journal. Alright. Oh, look at us. Oh my luck. god. But then the Wait a minute. Covered our track, so now we wait a bit, and we go back to Blackwater, and we get our money, or we get some more money. You actually write down a whole ass heading journal and stuff. West, but we're heading east. For now. Coulter. For now. We got this. We're safe. Stay it's pretty neat, though. Jose. So, do we read these? You guys want me to read these out? Coulter. We have been running for weeks. I mean, running more than usual. The job they was pulling in Blackwater, robbing that ferry, it turned into a disaster. Young jo Jenny got killed, poor thing, while Sean and Mac both got arrested or killed. Nobody seems sure which. Dutch shot a girl. I am not too sure if by accident or design. It seems like it might have been a setup. We took to the hills in an almighty scramble, leaving money and most of our things behind. So it seems like, yeah, so this is part of like what they're talking about, this boat. And things screwing up in the Pinkertons and stuff, so. Here we are, we're on the run, I guess. In a snowstorm. And uh, this is our camp for now. Seems like quite a little temporary camp here. And then we got our map. 
So far, this is what we have discovered. We're up here. And Coulter. All right. And then there's the Alders Ranch we went to for that guy. Okay. Easy enough. Easy enough. So before we start a mission, I was in the middle before when we were running all these cutscenes. I was trying to talk about uh, game suggestions and all that. Open to suggestions. Um, uh, pretty much anything. Anything. That's a story mode. Sorry. I, I'm open to anything that's like a story game, kind of like this. Maybe it's a linear thing. I've played many story games. As long as it's I could play it through single player, story mode. All right. That's what I'm looking for. I'm trying to get through some story mode games. I have a list of games I already own and all that. I have it on a website. I'm going to link the website to you. You go on there. You should be able to see all the um, games and stuff that I have on the list. And um, and yeah, if, if you want to suggest one off that list, would be the easiest because I already have that uh, on my uh, computer and stuff and, and ready to go. Um, but if there's any suggestion, maybe I'm missing a game in that list that is really good and I should try it out throw it in the comments sorry uh i i won't be able to play everything in, in in like really soon like right now right so but come time i'd like to uh i would definitely like to play through oh, many sorry. different games and we've been starting off oh, here, boys, so. let's start off the I next mission like old friends a couple of days on the lamb you lot have all turned yellow Apart from you, of course. Shut up, Micah. I ain't never seen so many long faces. Mm. I guess, I guess folks miss them. That fell. But when I fall, I don't want no fuss. When you fall, there'll be a party. <laughs> <laughs> what a party? <laughs> Probably. Uh -huh. Funny, huh? Sure. <laughs> oh, oh I don't dang. I'm like being laughed at by the likes of you two. Stop it now. You fools punching each other when Como Driscoll's needing punching hard. You want to sit around waiting for him to come find us? All of you, we got work to do. Come on. Are you sure about this, Dutch? Yes. Both been through a lot recently. We hardly back on our feet yet. And the last thing we need is to get bushwhacked by Como Driscoll. Let's go. I know you hate him, Dutch. He's here for us. I doubt that. No, you're just doubting me. I would never doubt you, Dutch. You. You always said revenge is a luxury we can't afford. This is the right call, Arthur. Take this. And this is about more than revenge got a rifle. for business long ago. They were talking about trains and detonators here. Cole always had good information. Come on. And you think now is the right time to hit a train? Now you... My fancy living on deer piss and rabbit shit. I'm getting too old for that life. Mr. Matthews, Mr. Smith, Mr. Pearson, would you please look after the place? There are O'Driscolls about. Yeah! All right. We're out of here. Dutch gave us a lasso. Southwest, right, Arthur? Yeah. He said follow the main trail southwest. They're camped near some lake. Okay, let's go find these bastards before they find us and rob this core of their planet. Oh, what's gonna happen? So far, there's quite a bit of shooting. I love it. I love it. Oh, horse tracks. Tracks. Horses, quite a few of them. I love how they just start. Just randomly. <laughs> out of nowhere. As far as I can tell, the only fools out here are us and them. They must be this way. You good, Dutch? Of course. Listen, I know you don't think much of my ideas recently, but this is the right move. Okay. You know I got your back. I learned a long time ago that you hit Como Driscoll. Wait for him, and people you love will die. Mm. This feud between you and him needs to be put to rest, one way or another. <laughs> it will be. Some things I can forgive, others I can forget. 
what he did to Annabelle? I can't do neither. You killed his brother, Dutch. Yes, I did. And I hope the bastards will be reunited. Oh, soon smoke. Enough. That's how this will end. They're over there. Smoke. Let's cut up here and take a look. They said it was near the lake, so we must be close. All right, here we go by the lake. We gotta take them out. Sorry. All right, gentlemen. This is it. Are we goddamn ready? Ready, Dutch. Ready. Now, Mr. Morgan and I, we're gonna head up here a little, see if we can't get a sense of the layout of the camp. Mr. Williamson, Mr. Bell, you two take up a hidden position just outside the camp. Mr. Summers, Mr. Escuela, you two, Hold position here. Let's go. Aye, aye. Hold on. Can I not get my gun? I thought you were going with Dutch. Yo. I don't need your little sass, all right, dude? I was just seeing if I can get my rifle. God damn. Ooh, we got Binox. All right. There they are. That's definitely them. Oh, this is quite the camp. I think so. Yeah, that's him. Oh boy. Where are they going? They're going somewhere, yeah? Who's he talking to? He don't seem very happy. No. Oh, he's getting slapped. Oh, no. They leaving? Seem to be. Should we go get him? No. He just got slapped. Cone can wait. Best to get some of them out of there. So we got one up in the tower. To rob him and his score if he never finds out about it. All right, let's go pay our old friends a visit. <laughs> okay. Don't forget to grab that rifle from your horse. Okay, now we grab it. All right. You two get up there and keep us covered. Sure thing. Wait. Oh, okay, we put rifle here. Okay. What is... Shoulder and back. Alright, so we'll put this on our shoulder. Sounds good to me. And then we'll have our revolver. On, well, go. I guess actually it's better to have the shotgun and a rifle. Because the revolver kind of acts as a rifle. Seems easiest Wait. to take the same oh. path down as Bill and Micah. Like you said, revenge is a luxury we can't afford. Yeah, just wasn't sure you agreed with me. Arthur. Arthur, have you completely lost faith in me? <laughs> Our needs right now are supplies, equipment, and a way out of here. Everything else, including Calm, can wait. Okay. There's enough of those bastards down there to deal with as it is. Now come on. Let's go. We're gonna walk all the way down there. I can't run. Hmm. 
I love that you could see the paths through the snow and all that. Oh, oh yeah. Oh, watch out! It's a bit steep. Just a bit. Just a bit there, Dutch. Look at this, though. This is amazing. The scenery is uh, incredible in this game. They're arguing down there. Maybe I should take the lead on this. They're going to be gunning for you. They ain't got me yet. No, but the way our luck's been running. Hush, let's just get down there first. Follow me. Let's head for that building in front. All right, let's go. And it's just still snowing, just still coming down. Stay low. Come on, follow me. Okay, let's get in cover. <laughs> so, what are we doing, Dutch? I can take this if you want. Just make the call. You want to take the lead? Go. Yeah. Saw him with my own two eyes. We don't have time to debate this. Extend the gang. Take the lead? Okay. I'll go first. You go. I wouldn't have done. Better didn't have much choice. Oh, Drish girls! You're dead! You son of bitches! That gun, okay, this gun shoots quicker than I thought. Oh, I like that. I'm moving up. Put some fire behind me. Go on and get to you next. What? I didn't hit him. Here, boy. Oh my, oh no. I'm not shooting very good right now. Dang, these cinematic shots though. What? Dude. Okay, so it's way harder to shoot than I ever thought. Dang, I, I got my cursor thing like right on the guy. Oh, I hit him. <laughs> oh, I'm looking at back at Arthur. I think that's all of them. Search the Damn. Bodies. Strip everything we can from them. We gotta search all the bodies? That's a lot of you bodies. Any of, them, Dutch? of course not. Colm doesn't give a damn about his men. All he cares about is numbers. If you can shoot a gun and ride a horse and kill without thought, you're in. Think how long some of you have been with me. I imagine Colm doesn't even know half the names of these horse stimulant. Heads up, what? boys! Oh, we're good. Oh, snap. There's more coming in. A lot of them where? Advance. Take them out. Yeah, right at them. We take them out. Not the other way around. Activate. Oh, okay. 
Okay. That's pretty neat. Did they even kill that guy? Use a tonic to restore tonic. Fully restores dead eye. Okay. So it's probably a good thing to to keep that good. Did we use it? Yeah, we drank it. Well, we got some bodies to loot around here. It says to use it. Maybe I did I not you Dead Eye Tonic. Maybe I slept the wrong one. Dead Eye Tonic. Which one, though? No, it doesn't show up on the screen anymore. We're getting some money off the bodies. We're rich. We got three dollars. We're improving our stamina as well here. Silver pocket launch. Yo, we're going to be able to sell this stuff for some good money. Alright, come back. Oh, more bodies. And we're getting ammo as well. God knows we're going to need a lot of ammo for how much we're missing. <laughs> I feel like I'm probably going to end up uh, turning down my... Aim sensitivity here. here. All right. Good work, boys. Now, let's tear this place apart. Oh, doing more searching, are we? You go search that wagon there. Mike, search that building. Arthur, you take that building to the left. Yes, sir. All right, man, quick. Find those detonators and explosives, anything you can. Let's go. Oh, we, oh, we got this some explosives. What do you think, Bill? Well, looks fine. Smells good. Come on. Did we get everything? Think so, boss. Found this on one of them. Thank you. This is perfect. Oh, yeah. Interesting. This is something about the train they was going to rob. A Mr. Leviticus Cornwall. Cornwall. Mount back up. Let's keep moving. Cornwall. All, All right. right. Let's get out of here. So now we're going to take boys. out the train, right? All of, you. of course Not we are. Down. Good work, fellas. Not bad for some starving down and outs. They can pummel us hard as they like. But we will always get back up and fight. That's who we are. Yes, sir. Outlaws for life, fellas. Wait until we have John back. Charles and Sean back riding with us, and I believe, I know, they will all be back. Oh, we'll have a good gang. Home, this head will hurt him a lot more than any bullet in the head. Especially when we rob this train, too. <laughs> yeah, I guess we'll see about that. Oh, indeed we will. You know, he'll come after us. Oh, of course he will, just like all the rest. But we're going to stay a step ahead of them. Make sure we always know where they are before they know where we are. We allowed ourselves to get a step behind in Blackwater. That won't happen again. Blackwater. All right, dig in, fellas. Let's make some ground. All right, so we got a step behind the black water. Hey, you see that fella? Wasn't he at the camp with Cone? Oh. Leave him to me. All right, we're heading back. Oh. Just bring him back alive. Oh, we're gonna lasso him. Okay. Here, boy. Ah. Y'all. Here, boy. Yeehaw! You got the wrong. Oh. <laughs> no. 
<laughs> Come here, boy. We're gonna tie you up. Oh God, no! Oh snap! All right, we're gonna pick him up. You got me mixed up with someone else. Oh, you're not mixed up, sir. This could get bumpy. Please. Hold on. Please, you don't need to do this. What's your name, boy? I don't know. You don't know your name. <laughs> it's Kieran. Kieran what? Duffy. Kieran Duffy. Well, I ain't gonna lie to you. This is a real bad day for you, Kieran Duffy. Where are you taking me? Somewhere you ain't gonna like. Why? What are you gonna do to me? Some fan you ain't gonna like. So I'd advise oh you to save your breath for screaming. No, please! Oh, I love it. Oh, Arthur is amazing. Oh, this character is good. What's your name? I don't know. <laughs> don't do this, please. Uh, almost had a horse stamina. Come on, mister. P -p Please. You better shut your mouth, you little shit, or I will shut it for you. <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh, I'm going to have a lot of fun listening to Arthur. Oh, yeah. That is what I'm talking about. Please, I'll do anything. Please. Oh, God. Nothing up real about him, honest. Are you trying to test me? Is that it? Because I will break every bone in your body. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Okay. Not one more goddamn word. Am I clear? Okay. Okay. That's two bones right there. Damn. Here we are, you sack of shit. Let's introduce you to the boys. All right, come here, Kieran. <laughs> don't hurt me, please. No, don't worry. They're real nice. Huh. You found a little shit, did you? Yep. <laughs> I got him. Very good. <laughs> Welcome to his new face home. in the snow. Hope you're real happy here. <sighs> you want me to make him talk? Oh, no, now all we'll get is lies. Uncle, Mr. Williamson, tie this maggot up someplace safe. We get him hungry first. I got a saying, my friend. We shoot fellas as need shooting, save fellas as need saving, and feed them as need feeding. We are going to find out what you need. I can't believe it. An O'Driscoll in my camp. No, I ain't an O'Driscoll, mister. I, I hate that fella. Oh, whatever you say, son. Well done, Arthur. I'm just sorry we missed out on coal. Oh, there's time enough for that. Now, I gotta figure out if we can hit that train. Okay. We're gonna hit the train. Yeah, let's get warm by the fire. We got another bronze. I'm not even gonna open the details and take a look at what we got wrong. <laughs> Absolutely not, sir. All right, do we go over? We're gonna go straight into the next one here, and then I think, depending on where we end off at the end of this, we're gonna starve to death up here, Mr. Morgan. We're probably gonna end this uh, this first You're part okay. off here. First part's off strong. We have a few cans of food and a rabbit for what? 10, 12 people. When I was in the Navy. I, I do not wish to hear about what you got up to in the Navy, Mr. Pearson. We were stranded at sea for 50 days. And you unfortunately survived. Dang. When we ran away from Blackwater, I wasn't able to get supplies in. Well, when government agents are hunting you down, sometimes shopping trips need to be cut short. We'll survive. We always have. If needs be, we can eat you. You're the fattest. <laughs> I sent Lenny and Bill hunting, and what? they found nothing. Well, Lenny's more into book learning than hunting. Bill's a fool. 
Unless those mountains are full of game that want to read, ain't no wonder they found enough of this. We'll go find something. Come on, Arthur. Wait a second. Hold on. Here. You're gonna need something neat out there. Assorted salted awful. Starving would be preferable. Come on, let's go. Jesus. You can't go hunting. Look at your hand. I can't stay here listening to you two. Look, if there's game in those hills, I'll find it. And you can kill it. You need to rest, Charles. You think this is rest? Come along. Touche? <coughs> Here, you take this. I can't use it, and you'll have to. Oh, you're joking. Use a gun, and we'll scare off every animal for miles around. <sighs> All right, here we go. Barn. I imagine. But one arrow. All right, let's head out. Yeah. So, uh, that guy saying he was like in the navy or whatever got me got me uh, reminded here. Man, I've been stuck watching um, up, a show. I'm okay. Apart from this hand, stupid mistake. Still bad. It'll be fine in a day or two. I just can't pull a bow right now. Always talking. Uh, sure, Always dialogue. I can. It's good though. I like Never it. really got the hang of it. You'll be fine. So, you reckon we're gonna find something to kill? It ain't no Driscoll. Huh. There's meat up here for sure. Pearson doesn't know what he's talking about. Now the weather's eased off a bit. They'll be needing to feed. We'll head up this way. Find some higher ground. I like it. But yeah, this show I've been watching, it's called The Last Ship. I'm on my, like, third watch, like, uh, third time watching through this. But it's such a good show. Going out for John, that thing with the O'Driscolls. You've had a lot put on you. I wish I could have done more. I didn't mean it like that, just a lot to think back on. I still don't really know what happened on that boat. Me neither. Well, Javier told me a bit, but it sure weren't good. But yeah, it's a good show. I've been enjoying watching it again for the like the third time. <laughs> but uh, I love the action scenes when they go in the battle and stuff. Oh, it's so good. It's the story's not like crazy. It's another post-apocalyptic show kind of thing or whatever. But I think I think it's done pretty good. Um, I enjoy watching it so. If you like an action, you like navy, you like boats, you like guns. It's a good show. But what's your favorite show? What do you got? What do you like watching? I don't know. There's so many different shows out there. There's a lot of good ones. Maybe you got a really, uh, really good show you like watching, or maybe there's a show that you keep coming back to, right? Watching them for the second, third plus time. See some of the ground uncovered here. Come on, let's try this way. Keep your eyes peeled for movement. All right. Yeah. The wind's died down too. That's good. No wind at all is bad, but if it's too strong, they won't move. Now shh, stay quiet. Whoa! Shouldn't we hey, slow down then? Stop here a second. I see something. You see something. We gotta get it off our horse. There's a deer been here. Oh, recently. We're not doing that yet. How can you tell? How can you not? Look at the tracks. Come on foot. You're gonna need the bow. Don't leave it on your horse. The gun will scare everything around. Yeah, well, I was trying to get it off earlier, but. Here we go. Quiet as you can. Stay low. And move slowly. All right. Don't run. They'll hear you coming a mile off. My bad. I didn't mean to. I'm talking about tracks. I think so. Maybe not. Focus. You can use eagle eye. Okay. I don't need eagle eye. I can see the tracks though. You can see them right here.
kind of just stops. We're going to have to use Eagle Eye. Okay, so you have to use Eagle Eye in some spots. Okay. Interesting. Weird that the tracks kind of... Oh, wait. Oh, never mind. They're just... They changed. The snow's not as deep here, so they actually are their prints. The deer prints. So it gets deep. Oh, my God. That is so amazing. <laughs> oh, I see it. I see it. Shh. Down there. You see him? Quick. Get that bow out, Arthur. Try to hit him in the neck or head. Quick and clean. You can pull back oh. quite hard. Oh, okay. So you can pull it back too much. Interesting. Okay. Here we go. Here we go again. Wait, we're kind of... We're not very steady right now. Focus, Arthur. We need this meat. Shit. I don't know how high to shoot. You just shoot right at the damn thing? I call... Selecting call while aiming at it. Oh, okay. So we do got we gotta call it. We also gotta take an item here. We need some health. Uh, or no, we need stamina. That's what we need. Do we have something that is just stamina? No, we'll have some of this though. Here we go. Oh, there's more over there. I just, I thought, maybe it's when my stamina was all the way down, that's when it was so unsteady, because I couldn't aim it that second time. It was so unsteady. I'm going to try to get up by this tree line here and maybe shoot from here over there. Shit. This is way harder than I thought, man. And I keep running out of freaking stamina. Well, that's what we're doing here. We're scaring them all off, apparently. We're gonna fail, man. Well, we're definitely not getting gold on this mission. It's probably get the, the deer in the first try. Where'd they run off to? No. Are we going to be able to... Oh. Oh. I got us to call it, but it made them flee. Maybe we not call it. We can hit this guy. This one right here. Ah, uh, actually. That's okay. Try again. What the heck, man? Oh, my God. There's no way, man. All right, don't put me up for hunting. God, no. Oh, shit, that didn't go anywhere. Good shot. Now it's so hard. Come on. You're making me seem too obvious. I, I thought we can, uh, you know, get it on the run. Do we not have to go harvest this stuff, though? We gotta, we gotta skin it and everything. We're out of stamina again? Bro. What the heck? Alright, I guess we don't do anything with it. They ran off this way. This is taking way longer than it should have. Where are you going? Follow the tracks. What? Oh. 
Oh. All the way up there. Can we hit it from here? Why didn't it shoot? It didn't freaking shoot. Oh my. You gotta be kidding me, man. It didn't shoot. I'm having all sorts of issues here. With deer hunting. Oh shit, there's one right there. Are you kidding me, man? Oh no, kill it. It's suffering. Did we get it? Well, it's dead now. Okay, that'll do it. <laughs> I think oh boy. That's all we can carry. Oh, we gotta pick it up okay. and bring it with us. You pick up one, I'll get oh my god. You sure your hands are okay? Uh, I'm gonna get this packed on my horse. We gotta get our stamina up because it. <laughs> yeah. Good haul, boy. Ready to head back when you are. Sure. I just need to finish up here. Yeah, don't put me up for the task of uh, hunting. No, 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 no. I aim. I, I do think I'm going to change the most sensitivity and then hopefully uh, we'll see. We're either going to be better or worse. <laughs> Okay, so this is the mission. We could bring all the, nice we could bring a deer to uh, Pearson and. Meat. Watch it. Okay, I'm sorry. It. Should be enough meat here to keep us all fed for a few days. You found him. <laughs> I knew you'd be okay with that bow. Yeah, it's easier when they ain't shooting back. <laughs> Actually, <laughs> no. That. Considering how things were looking a couple of days back, well, maybe our luck is finally on the turn. Seems to me we should be putting our effort into getting off this mountain now. Soon. People are still weak, and well, you've seen how snow and those from? wagons are. Oh, they ain't yeah. going nowhere until we get some more thaw. Mm, you're probably right. And even if we do get off here, what then? We still have a big price on our heads. This is a big country. We'll find somewhere to lie low. Dutch and Jose will have a plan. La low. Easy. You notice how Pearson's had a bottle in his hand ever since we fled Blackwater? We give the camp cook five minutes to grab the essentials and go, and he doesn't even bring a crumb of food. Good that we caught more than one. We've only been up here a few days and have already picked up two more mouths to feed. One more. We ain't feeding Neil Driscoll a damn thing. Oh shit. Except maybe that can of salt and awful Pearson was kind enough to give us. The girl. Which way do we have to go? Is, is this guy going the, the proper way? Shouldn't we be going up this way? She has a oh. wild look in her eye. We're taking the long way around. <laughs> of course. She lost her husband, her home, everything she had. So what do we do with her? Well, once we get out of here and we're back on our feet, we'll see. She might have family somewhere. Who knows? Maybe she'll deal with the O'Driscoll for us. <laughs> well, I know who my money's on in that fight. He's weak, but that makes him much more useful. Maybe we can get to them before they get to us. What is it with the O'Driscolls? You ain't dealt with them? I suppose. Yeah, we ain't run into them much the last six months. I guess because they've been over this way. Yeah, I've heard a lot of talk about them. Well, 
We've been scrapping over scores with them for years. Big gang. Nasty sons of bitches. Their leader, Cole, and Dutch go way back. And not in a good way. A proper oh boy. blood feud. So I heard. Bro. Watch out. Bear up ahead. Let's see if we can find another way around. Oh. We're not going to take this bear out? He must be real hungry. Stay well back. Spring storms like this are the worst for animals that sleep all winter. So we go all the way down here, and then now we have to find another way around. Where are you off to? Oh, never mind. We're, okay, we're continuing this way. Okay. We're just waiting for him? Cut up here. Why is my... Why would we do that? Bro, hello? <laughs> Bear has spooked your horse. Hold G to calm. It's okay, girl. It's all good. Dad is here. We ain't ever talked that much, you and me. How long you been with us now? Five, six months? Something like that. But you didn't expect this. What? Any of this. Blackwater mess. Being up here. Ah. Uh, sooner or later, a job's gonna go wrong. Nature of life. I just thought you might have moved on by now. You want me to move on? No. No, not at all. I just... I know you could run it alone. No problem. I did that for a long time. I'm done with it. I was wondering if someone's gonna kill you in your sleep. I still wonder Jesus. that most nights. <laughs> I reckon you're okay. This suits me. Sure. Hey! Uh, careful. I could fall in with another gang, but Dutch. You know, Dutch is different. Oh, yes. Dutch is certainly different. <laughs> he treats me fair. Most of you do. For a fellow with a black father and an Indian mother, that ain't normally the case. Oh, well, really? We need you now. More than ever. Good. And how long have you been with these boys? Why ain't you run off? Me? Oh. 20 years, something like that. Since I was a boy. 20 years? Yeah. You taught me to read. John, too. Taught me a few other things, him and Hosea. <laughs> I'm sure. Just saved me. Saved most of us. That's why we need to stick by him through this. He always sees us right. All right. Fair enough. Dutch is a good man. How's that new horse? He's all right. He'll do for now. I appreciate you letting me take Taima the other night. She's a strong one. It's been as hard on the horses as on the rest of us. I don't know what Dutch would do if something happened to the Count. Same with Bill and Brown Jack. He's a drunk, miserable bastard, but he loves that horse. Huh. I hope they all make it. I tried to ride the Count once. Buck me faster than a bull. Won't take nobody but him. Hey, y'all, Pearson, we got the I'm deer, man. Yo, yo. We're coming in. Oh, well, the ice is. Oh, we. Come on, let's get these over to Pearson. I didn't hitch the horse. Uh, thank you for showing me how I didn't. to use the bow properly. I only showed you a little. It takes a lot of practice to master. Wasn't giving me the prompt for it. There we go. All right. Good work, Bart. Just drop it down in here. Oh, okay. What if I put it on the table? Never mind. He's gonna put it on the table. All right. What a surprise! Slap her down. Find the camp rat loitering around in the kitchen. Is that any way to greet an old friend? I feel like we haven't spoken for days. I do my utmost to avoid. Why, he loves me really. It's his sad way of showing affection. No, it isn't. 
Now shoot, get lost. Uh, well, see you gents later. See, you got on just fine. Charles is a wonder. Have a drink, boys. You earned it. Jesus, what is that? Navy rum, sir. It's the only thing. The only thing. <laughs> Keeps you sane, it does. Yeah, it oh. seems to have done a treat on you. You go rest that hand, Charles. I'll be fine in a few days. You mind helping me with the skinning, Mr. Morgan? It's easier if we do it together. Go get to skin you. <coughs> oh, Jesus. You're always one with the jokes, aren't you? Come on. This really isn't a <laughs> job for a man with a burnt hand. I'll mm. see you both later. You skinned Dang. that one, you dumped on the floor there. All right. All right. Let's, uh, let's open her up. Oh, my God. This shit is so detailed. Well, I mean, like... Huh. Not too bad, Mr. Morgan. Yeah, they always said you were a butcher. You know, you could trade these or sell these in pretty much any town if you're looking to make a legitimate bit of money, of course. Right now, I'm just looking to get off this mountain alive. Well, if you catch anything else, you bring it to me. Sure. Thank you, Mr. Morgan. Heck, Arthur Morgan's first decent bit of hunting after all these years. Yeah. <laughs> Well, we're on the run now. Everyone's got to do their bit to survive. Just make a good stew. Folk need it. It's been a tough few days. <sighs> You've unlocked the Master Hunter Challenge. A few days later. Okay. Oh, it's not snowy anymore. It's been a bad few weeks. But Dutch. Being Dutch, he is busy Nothing. making plans, and Dutch being Dutch, those plans involve robbery and dreams. Well, I thought you was reading him his last rites. Now I see you're introducing him to your other passion. I'll mind you to show me some respect, Mr. Morgan. Mind away, Reverend. You still here, then? I owe you. Yeah, and you'll pay me. But for the moment, just rest. Arthur, I think it's time for the train. Want me to come? Of course I do, but look at you. I was always ugly, Dutch. It's just a scratch. Don't lie still, son. Hello, Abigail. Dutch. Jackie. The boy wanted to see you, John. He's seen me now. Or what's left of me. What about you? Guess I was hoping to see a corpse. <laughs> Bide your time. You'll see plenty of them. You're a rotten man, John Marston. He is an idiot, Abigail. We all know it. Now, railway man. Bill, now you ride ahead and set the charge at the water tower just before the tunnel. Ain't a problem. Why are we doing this? Weather's breaking. We could leave. I, I thought we was lying low. Yeah, come on. What do you want from me, Jose? I just don't want any more folks to die, Dutch. We're living, Hosea. We're living. Look at me. We're living. Even you. But we need money. Everything we have is in Blackwater. You fancy heading back there? No. Listen, Dutch, I ain't trying to undermine you. I just... I just want to stick to the plan, which was to lie low, then head back out west. Now, suddenly we're about to rob a train. What choice have we got? Leviticus Cornwall's no joke, Dutch. Well, who is Leviticus Cornwall? He's a big railway magnet, sugar dealer, oil man. Well, how good for him. Sounds like he has more than enough to share. Dutch! Gentlemen, it is time We're gonna to hit up a train. something <laughs> of ourselves. Get your horses ready. We Here we go. Oh, run. my God. We're going to take out the... We're going to get the charges ready. We got charges. All right. Let's head out. Oh, snap. Listen up, all of you. According to the information so kindly provided to us by the Chris, oh. the train will be coming north from Big Valley. <laughs> We're gonna pick it off after it crosses the border into the Grizzlies. There's a raised spot there that should give us good vantage. Charles, you'll keep lookout for any outriders. How's that hand, by the way? I'll be fine. Good. I'll take the driver and engineer, then run point. Lenny and 
Javier, you two take the front cars, deal with any guards. Arthur and Micah, you head straight for the back. That's what we're after. Mr. Cornwall's private car. You and me, Morgan. Great. Have you got a problem with that? Not if you keep your head for once. <laughs> you worry about yourself, huh? Enough! After Bill blows the tracks, we're gonna need to move fast. Is everyone clear on what they're doing? Yes, yes sir. Crystal. Yes, boss. Good. Now come on. Let's ride. All right. So far, uh, I'm enjoying this game a lot so far. I mean, like, I played it before, so, like, you know. But still. I love the cinematic, like, camera and stuff. good, doesn't it? But we need to get this done fast. Now it's thawing before anyone gets up here after us. Oh, look at you boys. See? This is what I call a crew. Micah Bell. Charles Smith. Oh. Micah Bell. Charles Smith. Arthur Morgan. Javier Escuela. And what about young Lenny here? Always the first man on his horse. Just Damn. happy we're back at him, Dutch. You sure you're ready for this, kid? Of course I'm ready. Just stay calm. Keep your eyes sharp. That goes for all of you. No What are you mistakes. doing? Not again. Get that horse in line, Arthur. I'm my bad. <laughs> so we do this. Then I'm we go back to Blackwater to collect. Sorry. How many times you gonna ask the same question, Micah? That's a lot of damn money to leave sitting for too long. It would be crazy to go back there now. The place will be swarming with Pinkertons. We go back when I say we go back, and that's the end of it. There's a water tower. Oh, Hold snap. Up here on the ridge. Here we go. Here we go. The train's gonna come down here. here. We're gonna blow it. Yeah. You want to head down? See how he's getting on? Okay. Easy. All right, we got to check on Bill. What? How you getting on? Yeah. I'm okay. You sure? Of course. Can I help a little? All right. <laughs> Go ahead and set up the detonator by those rocks over there. Okay, sure. Now just unspool the wire and then attach it to said detonator. All right. Let's go. Let's go hook it up. Oh, oh shit. We're putting the wire down. Oh, this is amazing. Did we get the pull of detonator too? Okay, this is good. All right, that should do it. You head back up to the others. I got it from here. Yes, sir. All right, so I guess we're not going to be pulling the detonator or what? Maybe we're doing this at nighttime. Never mind, we're doing this soon. It's What's coming going soon. On? He says all fine. We'll soon find out. Everything okay? I think so. Okay, cover your faces. Train should be here. I already switched. Okay. Oh, we got Train bandana here. Now. Oh, shit. Put a bandana on. Here comes the train. Gentlemen, it's time. 
Good luck. All of you. You all know what to do. Blow it. Here we go. Oh no. Shit, no! What? God! Oh, you have gotta be kidding me! Where did you find that more? You said it was fine. So it's my fault. Come on! Oh You're shit. Pathetic. You know that? Uh, Jump on the train. Oh my gosh, where's Oh no. Oh. He fell off. Alright, come here, Lenny. I can't lose another one. Shit. Oh, we do gotta tap, okay. Hold on. Move, boy. Boy, we best get up there. See me hook up the wire, man. We moving up? Oh no. What is wrong with you? I'm a hideous. How are you doing there? I'm okay. That's right, sir. We have to I'm getting my aim back. That's what we're doing, kid. I'm going up. We have to stop this train. We gotta loot the bodies too, right? We gotta get all the good stuff off of them. Oh! Oh no. Reverse the grapple. Break free. Oh, throw him off. Oh my god. E to stop the train. Oh, the train's ours now. Oh shit. Look out. Got more coming off the train. Ooh. There better be some money at the end of this. All these bastards must be gone soon. Oh shit. Whoa, that just like propel them back towards the train. It's not working. You can't shoot. I don't know how it works anymore. How did I? Oh, those are our guys. 
What? <laughs> I think those are the enemies, man. <laughs> yes, let's get the money and go. We got yeah, let's get the money, man. Ah, shit. What are you boys planning on doing in there? Listen to me. We don't want to kill any of you. Any more of you. <laughs> I give you my word, but trust me, we will. I work for Leviticus Corps. Come on, boys. We got our orders. Okay. You asked for it. We ain't Five, opening this door. Four. Three, two, one. <laughs> Seems our friends have gone deaf. Wake them up. Three, two, oh, one. Oh shit, you can rapid fire. That's enough. Mr. Williamson, give Mr. Morgan and Mr. Smith some dynamite. <laughs> you two boys go blow that door open. Oh shit. Now it don't matter too much to us, but you boys in there. That little toss over to him? Back. Oh, that was so cool. Seems good Here enough. We go. Now light the fuse. Unless you got a death wish, I'd step back, fellas. Oh, snap. Come on out. All right, come on. Just walk on out here. It's going to shoot them. <laughs> we don't want to kill you. My we just want to rob your boss. Get on up there. Search that train. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, we are rich tonight, boys. We are rich Look tonight. At this place. <laughs> it's like a palace. Well, now I've seen everything. Oh, you two got the safe? I'll search the rest. Oh, yes. Should be easy as cake. <sighs> we got a letter here. You're just gonna stand Let's take a look. What do we got? Brandy, will you? I'm parched. Shut up. Me and Dear Mr. Cornwall, we are yet to receive yeah, payment of $2,000 for the initial phase of exploration at the Wapiti Indi Indian Reservation. Amberino, as agreed in the contract between okay. Cor Cornwall Kerosene and Tar and the Leland open. Oil Development Company, dated November 9th, 1898. On receipt of the funds, we will proceed with phases two and three of the project. Excuse me. And present you with a detailed report of our findings within the month. Yours respectfully, James Critchley, head of accounts, Leland. We got the Leland guy too. Okay, he's in in business. It looks like. Bonds? I don't think so. Okay, we got another letter here or what? Here. Make yourself useful. At least we all know you can read. Give me those. Dear Leviticus, thank you for the telegram and for your continued interest in the Jameson Railroad Mining Company. Contract. However, any news Invoices, you have received of mismanagement blah, blah, or financial blah, difficulties at the mine in Annisburg. Are simply really fake, and I would urge you to question your sources. The coal industry is quite a different from the oil industry in a number of ways, so I certainly remain open Europe? to business meeting at your convenience to exchange ideas and educate each other on our respective areas of corporate expertise. I would also be delighted to host you in Annisburg and give you a personal Have tour of the mine and its associated facilities. I look forward to further correspondence. Yeah. Yours sincerely, Archibald Jameson. Come All right. On. Yeah, we got a few letters, it seems like. Any luck, Arthur? Nothing much yet. Oh, there's a box no, here, though. Looks like something. Looking. It's goddamn O'Driscoll. Oh. These just seem to be contracts. Arthur, I think I got them. I got a bond. Thank God. Come on. Some cigars. But yeah, I think we uh, I think we got everything then. Oh, hold on, we can search the drawer. Might be some good stuff here. Are you done in there? No. See, bill stack, more money. Look at that, twenty-five dollars. Oh, we're rich now. Oh, are we ever rich? You can't carry any more of this item. What? Wait. I can carry that silver pocket watch though. Or platinum. Just waiting on you, Arthur. Hold on there, man. Jesus. Be patient. 
I'm grabbing all the what stuff and buy these bonds. They worth anything? Oh, sure. Bearer bonds. I think we can probably sell these pretty easily. Well done. Now, would you get rid of all of this? The train? Yeah, get it out of here. What about them? Huh. What do you think? I don't know. <laughs> it's up to you. Kill them, leave them here, take them with you on the train. Just make sure they don't send no folk after us. Okay. See you back at camp. When you get back, we'll be moving on. The rest of you, let's ride. Yeah. I think Arthur's character would kill these guys. He's got a lot of health. I think it was in in uh, Arthur's character to take these guys out for sure. They didn't open up the train car. They're being little shits. That's for sure. All right, now we got to get rid of the train. Well, we can loot more bodies, though. <laughs> We're going to be the richest Arthur Morgan in Red Dead Valley. All right, let's get rid of this train. Let it go. <laughs> Nobody on it. Oh no. What's gonna happen to the train? It's gonna go. It did. Oh, for Lord's sake. Eastward bound. So, we getting out of this hellhole? We're gonna try. Weather seems stable. And we just robbed the Leviticus Cornwall train. We got money in our pockets. The worst is behind us, gentlemen. So the question uh, is, where now? I know this country a little. I told you, we should set up camp in Horseshoe Overlook near Valentine. We'll be able to hide out there no problem, as long as we keep our noses clean. <laughs> well then, let's go. Clean noses and everything else. Arthur, you're in that one. Bring Hosea. I know you two like to talk about the good old days and what's gone wrong with old Dutch. <laughs> oh, God. All right. Out we go. Bang. All right, we're done with that snow mountain area. Look at this waterfall. Oh, it's amazing. This could be a movie. <laughs> Straight up. <laughs> so good. It'd be a long ass movie, but. Like the way they make the like the way that they have made this, like so cinematic and everything. They did a really good job. And this is just the beginning. The music. Lenny! Micah, get over here! Yes, boss. You two ride up ahead, make sure there's no surprises. We've had enough of those. Me? With the boy? Just go. Come on, kid. You can buy me a whiskey. Holden. 
Dang. Look at this waterfall and everything. Get us out the stream. Gotta keep us moving, but calm. Oh! Oh no. I saw that wheel wobble okay. and I'm like, uh-oh. Let's take a look. You all right back there? Does everything look all right? Well, what's going on? Ah, I broke the goddamn wheel. All right, let's get it fixed. You need help? I reckon we can handle it. Lost right, a wheel Charles, bearing. Hold the thing up while you try and put the wheel back on, Arthur. You still strong enough to hold up a wagon? Shut up. I'm just saying. Don't say less. Pick the wheel up. <laughs> Just bash yeah, it back yeah. on here. That's yeah. good as new. <laughs> Are you See? kidding me? You ain't so useless after all. <laughs> Not quite. Okay, okay. See, that's the problem there, is just having one lug nut. What do you think? <laughs> if they wanted trouble, we wouldn't have seen them. Hello. Poor bastards. We really screwed them over down here. Come on, let's not push our luck. What happened? Well, get in. I'll tell you. Not too far now. Stay on this trail. We'll follow the river, then cut left inland. Yep. So, oh yes, the Indians and compass. Wait, really? Oh, Fox that is so cool. Deal. Oh my God! We're going to. I didn't know there was a thing. Farming and grazing country, they lost it all. Stolen clean away from them, it was every blade of grass. Killed or. Heard it up to the reservations in the middle of nowhere. And how's that different from anywhere else? Well, maybe it's not. I just heard some of the army out here was particularly uh, unpleasant about it. Unpleasant? How do you rob and kill people pleasantly? We don't, in spite of that, just talk. I fear I was perhaps trying to simplify He's something more complicated for the benefit of our blockheaded driver here. Hey, don't blame it on me. Never forget, this here's a con man, Charles, born and bred. Just because it sounds fancy don't mean he knows a damn thing about what he's talking about. So, what happened to your tribe? I don't even know if I have one. At least, not that I can remember. My father was a colored man. He told me he lived with our people for a while. A number of free men did, but when we were forced to move from our lands, the three of us fled. I was too young to really remember much. My whole life I've been on the run. A couple years later, some soldiers captured my mother, took her somewhere. We never saw her again. We drifted around. He was a very sad man, and the drink had a mean hold on him. Around 13. I just took off on my own. That was about the age we found young Arthur here. Maybe <laughs> a little older. A wilder delinquent you never did see. But he learned fast. Not as fast as Marston, apparently. Wait, I don't understand. What's the problem between you two? Arthur? Yeah, it's a long story. Oh, is it a long story now, huh? Are we still heading the right way? That depends. Are we still heading west in search of fortune and repose in virgin forests as we planned? No. No. Are we heading in the correct direction on our desperate escape from the law eastwards down the mountains? Yes, yep. I believe so. You know this area? A little. I've been through a couple of times. There's a livestock town not too far from here called Valentine. Cowboys, outlaws, working girls, our kind of place. Driscoll's? Probably them too. Pinkertons? Let's hope not. And this place we're going. Wait, but what's it called again? Horseshoe Overlook. It's a good place to lie low. It'll do for now. 
And how low do you think Dutch is really going to lie? <laughs> it's just, you know, maybe it's me who's changed, not him, but we kept telling him that fairy job didn't feel right. You and me had a real lead in Blackwater that could have worked out. Maybe. It just isn't like Dutch to lose his head like that. Things go wrong sometimes. People die. It's the way it is. Always has been. Me, you, Dutch. We've all been in this line of work a long time. And we're still here, so... Well, I figure we must have got it right a hell of a lot more than we got it wrong. I guess that is true. That is very true. Alright, Horseshoe Overlook, here we come. Working on there, anyway. <laughs> Just some yarrow and ginseng. Good for the health. Better than that stuff you buy in the store. Yeah. Oh. You can have all this. I'm at the point where I can do it with my eyes closed. Oh, okay. Thank you. All right. Thank you very much. Got some herbs. Oh, now we can go quick. Yeehaw. Head in there. Follow the track for a bit. Thanks. Hey, slow up. I'll jump on. All right, hurry up. Get on, boy. Okay, let's go. Yep. Here we go. Oh yeah, this Any is a good spot. In, here, in the woods. Nope. It went well. This is a good spot. Excellent. I think this will work for us, Arthur. For now, anyway. Yeah, off the trail. Look at this. We got an overlook. Oh, this is amazing. Here we are, gentlemen. Home sweet home. Hell yeah. You weren't wrong, Jose. This place Here is perfect. I hope so. Gentlemen, we have survived. For now. Now it is time to prosper. Arthur and I were about to prosper in Blackwater. We were on to something big. Then Micah got you all excited about that ferry, and here we are. We have all made mistakes over the years, Hosea. Every last one of us. But I kept us together. Kept us alive. Kept the nooses off our neck. I guess I'm just worried. I ain't got that long, Dutch. I, I want folks safe before I go. Me too. And now we are stuck. East of the Grizzlies and out of money. And a long way from a dream of virgin land in the West. I know, my brother. But we are safe. We make a bit of money here. Then we move again. Head out around them. Be west of Uncle Sam. In a few months, buy some land. I hope so. Would you just look around you? This world has its consolations. <laughs> Gentlemen. I'm going to head into the local town and, uh, you know, see if I can strike up a little business. Of course, Herr Strauss. I prefer robbing banks to usury. It seems more dignified somehow. Now, everyone, put your tools down for a moment. Come on, gather around. Quickly now. I know that things have been tough, but we are safe now, and we are far too poor. So it is time for everyone to get to work. Get to work, but stay out of trouble. Remember, we are itinerant workers. Laid off when they shut down our factory to the north. Now get out there and see what you can find. Uncle, Reverend Swanson, no more passengers. <laughs> it is time for everyone to earn their keep. There is a town a little way down the track named Valentine. Livestock town, all mud and morons, if I remember right. That seems a decent place to start. And, uh, we need food. Real food. That means every day. One of you. And remember, whatever it is that you find, the camp gets its slice. Now be sensible out there. Now the girls have your tent ready, Mr. Morgan. Come with me. You two will be ready shortly. We put you over here. I'm sure everything will be fine, Miss Grimshaw. It should be. Most of your stuff from Blackwater got saved. Everything apart from hmm. my money. Oh, don't remind me. Well, 
We can always make more money. We're going to have to. Oh, Miss we're, Jackson, I've we're going to make money. So we got to donate money. We got to we got to do all that good stuff. Donate to our camp. Upgrade stuff in it. All right. Well, here we have it. Chapter two. That was chapter one completes. All right. Very, very nice. Couple of weeks later. Got off the mountain, rode east into some pretty enough country called the Heartlands. Ain't been this far east in many a year. Dutch seems a little better. His eyes are sparkling once more, and I can see he's thinking a little clearer. I think we all feel a little happier, in spite of black water and that whole mess. Arthur? Jose? <laughs> Quite a day. Let's hope so. There's a bunch of the boys already in Valentine. Bill, Charles, and Javier. And Swanson found something down at the train station by the lake, apparently. And Strauss came back with that creepy little smile on his face. I'm sure there's a whole list of unfortunates he's forced money upon. <laughs> Thank you. And you? I'm gonna read a book. <laughs> Reading a book. Like that. All right, so here we go. We just, uh, when you gain or lose weight. Gain or lose weight? Oh, my. Do we get stronger and everything, too? I'm sure we got strength and all that crazy stuff. A lot of stats we need to pay attention to. Um, Yeah, so we have our camp. We got a gold medal for once. That's crazy. <laughs> oh, Arthur, my boy. My dear boy. What's going on? Nothing. Nothing at all. For the first time in weeks, nothing. We're free. We're free to plan our own futures once more. I hope so, Dutch. You kept the faith, Arthur. You always kept it. And I ain't losing it now. All right. This is my tent. Take. Where was it said that the sewing kit was? Not the sewing kit, the shaving kit. Morning, Mr. Morgan. Wait. Where did it say it was? Shave. Here we go. This is your current length? I say we go down one. Oh, you can change each, each thing like individually. I think we're gonna go down to three right now. Let's go with that. Did it? Did it do it? Oh, uh, select. There we go. We'll go with that for now. All right, so we got missions available now. We got one in the camp, one up in Valentine, and one by this uh, station here. All right, so we have uh, we finished chapter one. Bam! Holy moly, that was two hours. <laughs> Dang. All right, so that is going to do it for the first part here. We've made it to our camp at the Overlook. We finished chapter one. 
So I wonder how these chapters play out then. Oh, we got a progress here. 5% done the story. See, we got chapter. So some of these chapters are probably going to be like many videos long. Oh, I, I think. But yeah, here we have it. We are on our way. Thank you guys for being here and, and watching and everything. Uh, I do appreciate it. We are going to keep on trucking through this game. My plan is to do uh, about five days a week. Red Dead is going to be in the evening time. That is for like North America evening time. And then I'm going to continue doing Hogwarts Legacy in the mornings. Um, again, we're trying to aim for about five, five days a week or so. Uh, we're going to be doing a, like a two hour ish video. So here we have it. The beginning of an adventure with Arthur Morgan. Thank you guys again. And uh, I'll catch you guys later. Peace.